for. And um, my name's Jane Fifield. And my operation before was to record the question and answer and then share it with the community, mm -hmm. either through next door, YouTube video, Indivisible, um, a part of Indivisible Clackamas. So I think the expectation is that you're at a public event. Mm -hmm. And I think that I felt crippled in this meeting. I, anyone else feel uncomfortable getting recorded? Yeah. You do. Okay. Yeah. So I will cut you out. I will cut you out. I will cut you out. So, and you too. Okay. So, so do I'm not doing it for surveillance. Right? I'm doing it to expand access to people who, uh, might, not to who may not be able to see this and to, and to get the word out to people about the legislature and what's going on. I think we all have to be involved. I think I think the way yes. it's hard, yeah. hard. Yeah. I think um, I don't mind you clipping me, uh, in particular, especially around um, providing particular. I'm impressed your phone has that much um, room on it. Yeah. 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 Mine would be dead and blanking right. at me by now. You, you're um, looking at this brick here. <laughs> but this, this is not a public meeting, so I think people do come with an expectation sometimes um, that they can ask more personal questions. Right. And I want to be sensitive because uh, I do this rather than particular office hours because it's easier for people to drop in, hear stuff, ask questions. But we have had in previous constituent coffees, people offer some pretty personal details. Um, and I want to make sure that we're creating uh, an environment where people feel comfortable sharing issues that they may be having in their personal professional life where they may not want their employer to, to know that they've come and asked me these questions um, some people may have a personal interest in something that conflicts with their professional work. And uh, and so I think to the extent I've always expected everything that I do in a public venue is totally a fair game. Um, and I know that is, uh, if Jean, you can think about how you can excerpt me in this as you post stuff. Um, being sensitive to other people, that would be really helpful, I think, in creating an environment where people want to continue to come to this and ask me questions. Okay. I, people, I'm not, um, I think it breeds distrust when public officials don't like to be recorded. Um, I'm young enough that I know that I will probably misstate something anyway, and you can help me yeah. state yeah. it better, or maybe I might have missed something. Um, and if you do a feedback later, if I said something that didn't land right with you, please let me know, because it does help me be a better public official. Uh, and be more cognizant of what I'm saying even at 9 o'clock in the morning on a Saturday <laughs> when we had one cup of coffee. Uh, so I want to say thanks for coming. Um, I personally am entirely open to being recorded. I think that um, given the interest in my particular committee work, I, I 
very much understand that people want to hear um, yeah. this. So with those parameters, I want to say thanks for coming. Um, if you have particular constituent casework things that maybe didn't come up or you didn't feel comfortable sharing, um, given that we were being recorded, do feel free to email us. Um, we can be sensitive around that and uh, help you work through some, if you're having